Welcome back to Morning in America. It's time for American Hero. People everywhere are hugging their loved ones, especially their children, a little tighter after the mass shooting that killed 19 students and two teachers at Robb Elementary School in Uvalde, Texas, back in May. Now, one man is making sure the victims will be remembered in a beautiful way. Sean Peacock, a small business owner in Eastman, Georgia, and his team worked overtime to make 21 custom memorial benches by hand. They were driven in a U-Haul. They uh, were in a trailer driven for 1,200 miles or more, where Peacock personally delivered them to each family. And you can see the hand craftsmanship there. Uh, Sean is joining us live right now. Thank you uh, very much uh, for joining us and for what you've done uh, for the families. Was there a personal reason that you wanted to get involved like this? Um, God prompted me into action. Um, years ago, after the loss of my sister, Donna, I developed a uh, butterfly bench for my mama. Um, it helped her at a at a time when she buried a child. So it was uh, very personal. It sounds like it. And thank you so much for sharing uh, what a, a personal story. Um, there was somebody who contacted you in Uvalde to make a bench. Was that how it started? That is correct. Um, May 31st, I had a message in my Etsy store from Miss April, who is the mother of McKenna, who was tragically killed in that school. And she sent me a message um, just inquiring, could I customize one of these benches for the loss of a child? Uh, she didn't let me know she was from Texas. Um, again, God just prompted me to discover who she was. And um, we went to work shortly after um, with a GoFundMe. When it comes to developing the concept for each bench, what do you find is one of the most remarkable things that comforts those who are grieving? Every part of the bench. Um, you know, we worked with the families to, they provided us with the, the photo that they wanted to use. They provided us with the inscription so most every part of this is just as important as the next. Um, what is uh, the response from these families who've seen the benches and um, clearly are looking for some peace and some closure? The response was a very much appreciated act of love from one community to another community. Um, I have 21 extended families now. That's beautiful. Um, what, what, when, it, it, I only have a few seconds, and I feel like I need to ask this question. What's something that's helped you uh, personally uh, when it comes to bearing through the grief process that maybe people at home would learn from? My creativity is how I deal with loss. Um, my you know, we all uh, deal with um, grief in different ways. Some shut ourselves in closets, some people write, some of us draw, and um, that's how I was able to work through my own loss. Sean, we really appreciate you. Bless you and your family for what you've done Thank for you. these families in Uvalde. Thank you very Thank much. You. Have a wonderful week. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.